These eight. is filming me today and uh, our dog is back here in front of us as you saw the video already we were out for a walk today was a fantastic day and we had some fun outside and we got really hungry and we decided to make some salmon we love eating salmon in our family and I'm going to show exactly how we do that and have a lot of fun and I hope that you see this video and try it at your home and that's the reason why we make this video so easy and look really beautiful because you try that home for your loved ones and for yourself that you could have some restaurant quality food on your table. That is the whole point of our channel. Please share the video if you like and give us a thumbs up and, sub and subscribe to our channel that we could keep on working and do some great videos and uh, have fun with each other. Let's dive in. And we've got our fish in there. So now the most important thing is that we are going to do a sauce. It's going to be a butter sauce, super easy. I've got a full lemon, four, four cloves of garlic and some melted butter and some seeds. This is just some normal pumpkin seeds. So, um, I've just squeezed four cl cloves of garlic here and I've got half a lemon. And uh, I'm just going to squeeze that in. Make sure that you ha don't have any seeds in there. Oh, this is gonna taste fantastic, people. Need to try this. And we've got four cloves of garlic. I've already melted my butter. So, and I've got a bit of rosemary, some good flavor. You could use some uh, fresh rosemary, but we obviously didn't find any today. So we are using some dried up rosemary. So once you're done, you are going to just pour it all over. But before that, make sure it's not going to run away or run outside from this uh, foil. You just pour it all over here. Yeah. Got my salt here. And a little bit of pepper to give that kick. A little bit, just a little bit of pepper to give some kick. Please make sure that you are not over seasoning your salmon with pepper because uh, you want to enjoy the taste of your salmon. And I've got some onions here, which was just less left over from our food yesterday. So I'm going to use that on the sides because the fish is going to release a lot of fat once, once it's getting into the oven. So we've got some butter sauce in here. So make sure that you close it good that nothing is gonna get out so 
So you make sure that none of those saws and the fat which is going to render from this fish is going to get out. You take some more oil. And you make sure that you close this completely. Yeah? That it's not getting some direct burns on the meat. Yeah? So guys, now it's done. We are going to throw this bad boy into the oven. I have preheated my oven with 180 degrees Celsius and this is going to take from 15 to 20 minutes. You need to make sure that you get your salmon out in 15 minutes if it's thin and, and, and you need 20 minutes if it's a bit thicker. So it depends on the size of your salmon. So the baking time is usually between 15 to 20 minutes. But if you just put a fork inside and the flesh falls apart, it's perfectly done. I'll show you later, it's going to be pink on the inside. That's some fantastic stuff going on, guys. So we are in our kitchen and this is our oven and it's already preheated. It's going to get a bit louder. Bear with me, let's throw this bad boy inside. Make sure that you get your face off from the oven because if it burns, it burns you bad. So, see you in 15 to 20 minutes. Now everybody, it's a moment of truth. Let's unwrap our foil and let's take a look what we've got in there. Oh man, this smells incredible. I'm gonna just put this aside for a moment. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Take a look at this. Take a look at this, people. Wow. So, we're going to taste our food right now and uh, we'll let y'all know how it really tastes. God. <laughs> it's just delicious, <laughs> or not? Yeah.